a while ago I made this plugin for Word um, <clears throat> to help me writing emails and um, all sorts. Um, I always find that my emails tend to be really boring because I'm quite lazy with my word use. I just fire them up really quickly, use the same words over and over again. Um, uh, the default with Word, like the vocabulary that's inbuilt, isn't that great. Um, I always like find myself like going to and from if I'm making an effort from the browser to try and get better words. So I thought I'd kind of integrate that, um, make it more fluid and have it within the um, the actual word processor. Um, there's actually uh, plugins you can write uh, in C Sharp. Um, so I made one. Um, so hopefully it will be of some use to other people. I'm going to show you exactly what it does um, and how you can install it. And, um, it's quite straightforward. So, you know, standard text and you're writing away. Um, same old thing over and over again. You just use the same descriptive words and you don't really have much. Um, you don't think about it, you just get out there. Um, so instead of going into your browser, here they are, all these different variations, and you can really get through um, your process, your word processing really quickly. Um, so you could change that humanity. Um, yeah, humans. Okay, but you get the idea. Um, so it's quite a powerful thing. So you can download this on my GitHub. Um, GitHub.com forward slash dunker. It's got KR at the end. Um, so that's their word processor. Is. So if you don't have Git installed, you should. But if you don't, you can just download the zip there. Um, but yeah, I highly recommend you get Git because it's amazing. Um, if you're used to Git, uh, really straightforward. You just make a clone. Uh, it's not very big. There we go. Start open in Visual Studio. If you don't have Visual Studio, um, and you don't have a friend who can just build this for you, um, if you let me know, give me an email or something, I can build it for you. Um, so it's a really simple project. Um, the most important part is here. I'm actually using um, an API from abbreviations.com. They're pretty good, uh, but they do have a limit for the free use. Um, so you need to like log in, create an account, because if I give you mine, then it'll expire quite quickly. Um, so you can apply for the API and if you want you can pay for it, it's pretty cheap I mean for the benefit if you're doing any sort of um, any amount of like text it's so handy um, yeah so that's quite straightforward there's, all, there's other ones available um, like dictionary.com I think has one as well and um, I just found this one um, it's quite straightforward so, yeah, you just pop the key in there, it's a string, and then, yeah, it builds the uh, URL. So when you right-click, um, and then you can just build it, um, or you can, yeah, you can actually package it up as well, and then send it to your friends or whatever, publish, and yeah.
And then once you're done, you can uh, have some more interesting uh, emails and text without using the same words over and over again. Cheers.